your girl Trine and welcome back to my channel. Listen y'all, I am back with another story time. I know you're like, dang girl, easy ish just happened. Saturday. I decided to share this story. Let's jump right into this story time. Maybe like 10 o'clock at night or like 10.30, something like that. I was on Twitter and lately I've really just been into following people that I find inspiring, people that I have a genuine, you know, connection with, that I like or that I admire. And most of those people have been like influential people or people that are really artistically inclined. With that being said, I do follow one of my favorite new male actors. I say new because of the new millennium, Kofi Cerebo. Now I'm sure the ladies might know who Kofi is. I love you from Kofi, okay? The oh, boys are really everything, honey, okay? We don't give our chocolate men enough credit. Kofi made a tweet. I read the tweet and the tweet is like I'm about to start calling some of y'all. I kind of felt like he was joking or maybe he was hacked or something like that. media today is honey, everybody get hacked. Everybody blames stuff on getting hacked and it ain't them and whoop whoop whoop. So I figured maybe he just hacked or maybe he playing or whatever. I don't know. Guess a lot of people were thinking along those lines because then he tweeted something else. Oh y'all think I'm playing. I think I might have responded to that tweet. I think I might have tweeted something back. LOL. LOL. Okay. And he tweets something else. He goes, like, I'm about to make my DMs available. I'll send me y'all numbers so I can call some of y'all. Initially, I don't think I was thinking to send my number. I think that I was just like, ah, that ain't my speed. You know, that's not really my thing. You know, but something in my head, I guess that the devil in me was like, girl, send your number. I. DM said something like, let me see if you're playing or not. So I continue about my night. I completely forgot all about it. I was watching whatever I was watching, getting ready for the next day, because like I said, the next day was Easter Sunday. I just, I didn't think anything more about it. So I want to say about 45 minutes to an hour went by, and I, um, I'm on my phone watching something at the time. And oh Lord, if I'm in the middle of something, I hate to be interrupted, honey. Oh my goodness, that'll tick me off worse than anything like I think I might have been like editing a video or something like that so that really ticked me off um because I get the I get the unknown phone call out of nowhere and I'm real sketchy about unknown phone calls I don't do the unknown phone call thing you know I'd rather you call me on a number than to call me unknown okay because I'm just saying in my day in my day I have not come across too many pleasant unknown phone calls Really answer maybe I'm being bad and bougie don't know but it's not really my speed because I'm not I'm not at an unpleasant place so I don't want to answer unpleasant phone call I don't answer I send the shit right to voice I click that bitch so hard I like them in the middle of something and somebody got the nerve to call me and they call me unknown like at least call me known I don't even think nothing of it so I continue on with what I'm doing all of a sudden I see that I have a voicemail still don't think nothing of it. I still go about whatever I'm doing. Maybe about 30 minutes after that, I decide to check the voicemail. Biatch. The voicemail was from Kofi Damn Cerebro. Kofi called my phone. Kofi called me, B, and I sent him to the voicemail. I'm gonna let y'all hear the voicemail in a second, but it's so funny because as I'm listening to the voicemail, I'm like, it still doesn't even register to me who it is, even though the person says their name. But the ding ding moment in my head went off when he was kind of like, you know, thank you for sending me your number. I'm sorry that I missed you. I tried to get you. Biff, when I tell you my heart dropped, to heck, why would I send Kofi to voicemail? It wasn't even like a super, it wasn't even like, hey, this Kofi. Da, 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 da. It was like a, a decent enough. He said enough things in there. He, he touched base on enough things that we could have been talking. After I hear the voicemail, I'm like freaking out in my head. I run to my mom. My mom is the one who turned me on 
to Queen Sugar. I run into my mom's room. I'm, I'm like, girl, wake up, girl. We got to talk. Get up, get up, get up. I give her a quick little rundown to the store. Boom, boom, boom. Twitter, boom, 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 boom. I'm like, girl, he called me. I sent homie to the voicemail. So I put the phone to mommy ear. I let her hear it. She has sleep though. Yeah, that definitely is him. My gosh, I know, right? She's like, yeah, that's definitely him. Here she, here, here she go, here she go. She's like, Dad, I would still be picking my face up off the floor. I'm like, yeah, Ma. Yeah, yeah, rub it in. Rub it in, rub it in, rub it in, you know? Rub it in some more. I'm not sure if I let it ring like once or twice, like it might have rang once. Here's the voicemail. Make sure that my volume is up. I hope that y'all can hear it. Yo, what's up, man? It's Coach Thank you for the support. Thank you for uh, thank you for seeing your number. Happy Easter, and I'm sad you missed my call. <laughs> Bye, we'll talk to you soon. Yeah. it for my story time i hope that you guys enjoyed it thank you for watching make sure that you like comment and subscribe to my channel i'm gonna be coming at you guys with more content and more little funny videos and i hope that you enjoy it make sure that you like comment and subscribe to running a channel <laughs> okay i'll see you guys in my next video man i'm out of this mug peace